What up, YouTube? What's up, YouTube? It's your girl, Pretty Eyes Atkins, and thanks for joining me in Coco's World. I just had to come back on, talk to you guys for a minute on my drive, just to run a little errand real quick. Today is 420, so I got like a little inside scoop on some deals, so I'm going to go handle that, get my good shit on. But um, yeah, I want to come back on and talk about the interview that Seven did with Toxic Diamond about daytime tea time, spilling all the tea, <laughs> spilling all the tea, daytime tea time. You a messy little boots, aren't you, girl? Behind the scenes, because I have been watching a little drama play out between you and Toxic Diamond. A while back when it happened and it was like wow you know she really did this type of stuff and she really was out here sneaking and creeping and doing shit behind the scenes that was kind of underhanded to other youtubers but then when the shoe get turned on the other foot i guess you don't like it huh girl don't be that way don't be that way. If it's good enough for the goose, like my mom and auntie and them used to say, then it's good enough for the gander. Because you can't go around doing these things to people. You don't expect people not to catch on to you and not to retaliate. You threw a narrative out there and knew it was going to stick. Because you knew a lot of people had it out for Tasha K. You knew a lot of people don't like Tasha K. So you threw that narrative out there about how oh, fuck everybody that has something to do with the Wendy Williams interview and include the Tasha name in that. Now I need to backpedal on what I said before earlier because I did say something about how could it be on and have her emails and I guess it's not that. I guess she was saying that her whole YouTube and everything was hacked and that somebody else or either somebody else wrote that, I'm not sure if that's what she was saying, but I'm backpedaling, I'm backpedaling on what I said because I was wrong. I was wrong on what I had said, so I got my I got my facts out of order. And I'll be the first to admit to say I got my facts out of order. It was, but it was, I'm sorry, I'm, you know, I am what I am. I'm human, I'm not a robot or nothing like that, so you know. But uh Nobody not to retaliate. And then in the back end, you sit up here asking this lady, can you give me time till I figure out? Can you give me time till I figure out? Can you give me time till I figure out? That's all I can, you know. But why are you asking her to do that? But then you throwing this woman out to the wolves out here on YouTube. Knowing there's a lot of people out here that don't like Tasha K. That's on them. They got their bag and they hang up. I, I like her. I watch her. I'm subscribed to her. I like her antics. I like how real little woman she is. I like how whether people or not agree with her or not. Everybody gonna like who they like. Period. That's period. Everybody gonna like who they like and everybody gonna dislike who they, who they dislike. Period. I'm not in no clique. I'm not forming no clique. I'm not in no crews. I'm not in no uh, nothing. Like I'm not in no gang. Cause to me it's like a gang. I'm not, people are too old for clicks and crews. And when I say clicks, I mean like how they come up now, like back when I was growing up, it's gangs and it's, uh, it's gangs and stuff like that. But then you have your clicks and then you have your crews and all that. I'm not in none of that. I just like who I like and I support who I support. Period. Just period. All the extra antics with grown ass people, with grown ass adults, and some of them is really, really like my kids' age, like 26, 27, 28 years old. Um, but you're still grown, but then those are like, those are the type of games that y'all people are playing on YouTube. When really in actuality, y'all are like 30 something, 40 something, 40 something, 50 something years old, playing these same type of games. like. I just saw April video that, that she did, I guess a day ago, saying that, and I'm talking about April Walker, 
stop her, saying that mods were blocking her from Rita's chat. I mean, why why do mods want to become mods so bad? Is it because they want to do underhanded and sneaky shit behind the low? Is that what it really, really, really is? And then we grown adults here? Like, we grown people and this is what we want to be mods for and get up under and get behind the YouTuber, the content creator, I mean, and be their mod to do some dirty shit? Why? get it and I don't understand like I don't I, I really don't like why y'all just can't be good ass people and it's bringing me back to why I don't trust the motherfucker but why y'all just can't be good people and just just be have morals and standards about yourself why y'all gotta get behind somebody to store up some shit to store up some motherfucking drama like why is it that serious to do that at our ages like I said that YouTube the YouTube uh, empowerment that I called it last night on uh, Miss Gina's page and Miss Gina calling it the YouTube um, uh, she called it the uh, I'm sorry Miss Gina I'm just messing up all your little uh, your quote but uh, she called it a um, uh, YouTube uh, networking I'm sorry Ugh. I guess that's why I can smoke it so much <laughs> well, but yeah, YouTube networking, and that was beautiful. That was wonderful. I liked it. But don't nobody want to see that. I did a video on that this morning talking about how great it was and spoke a little bit on the Tasha K situation, just a little bit. But don't nobody want to see that. They want to see the drama. They want to see, and not saying that, oh yeah, I want to see the drama too, but I'm saying that's what people like. That's what they're doing right now. That's if the, if the, if the, if the, um, if the tag has a, a drama attached to it, we gonna click on it. And you notice I said we, so don't come for me, bitches. I said we, we gonna click on it because oh, now we wanna know what that's about. Or maybe we can do some content on that and what's that about? Okay, but what I'm saying is, why is that? Why, why is that? Why we can't click on more Supportive shit for one another. Why we can't click on more knowledgeable shit that you know we need to be watching instead of poisoning our brain with this drama and shit that's out here. We all are victim to it. We all, all of us, every last one of them, me included. But I'm just saying, I don't understand. I click on a lot of different things. Like I don't just click on the drama filled shit. I don't. I really, really don't. I click on a lot of different things. Because I'm interested in a lot of different things. That's just me and my personality. But, um, this whole thing with this Tasha K thing and everybody jumping on the, the hate, the hate train, the, the gravy train, or whatever they want to call it, just because Tasha is the goat out here. Tasha is a motherfucking beast, whether you like her or not. Tasha is a beast. She's doing her thing. I don't know what goes on in that lady's personal life, but nobody knows what goes on in her personal life unless you're dealing with her personally. So can't nobody really sit up here and say, oh, Tasha's a backstabber, and this, that, and the third. And she can't never hold a friendship. And she's always stabbing somebody and blah, 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 blah. Don't nobody want to hear that shit. Y'all do what y'all need to do to become a goat. Y'all do what y'all need to do and become as popping as Tasha doing her thing. Why well, hate on this lady because y'all hear things out in YouTube land and y'all wanna run with the y'all wanna run with the narrative. Cause that's what we do. That's what we do. You hear me saying we but see I'm trying to do better. I'm trying to do better with myself. I'm 40, I'll be 46 years old Wednesday. And I'm trying to do better with myself. So I'm not exempt to including myself in none of the bullshit that I'm talking about for real. I'm not all the extra bullshit and shenanigans that people be going through and doing. I got a man over here that's talking this morning at me, really trying to get my attention, y'all. And I'm ignoring him. Oh, no, I don't do none of the pulling over, baby. I'm sorry about that. Oh, no, no, no. No, no, no. No, no, no. I don't have time for that. I'm sorry. <laughs> he really trying to holler. He really hollering, y'all. Like, he honked the horn. I heard him honk. 
talking like 10 times. But I'm not paying them no attention because I'm talking to my people. And I'm trying to get my point across. But he look like he may be a cool little dude to be fucking with. He got a nice little ride, but I ain't. I, I'm not. Nah, I'm cool. Oh, you want to get over? Okay, go ahead and get over. So I don't know how to get over. But I'm not going to exchange no numbers with you, mister. I don't know you like that. But anyway. Are you trying to get over on me or what are you trying to do? Anyway. Like I was saying, everybody want to jump on the Tasha K hate train. And I think it's bullshit. I think it's bogus. I think it's a bunch of fucking hater vision and that's not cool. It's a bunch of hater vision. Why jump on another woman? See, my, my thing is, I'm the type of bitch, I like everybody to fucking win. I'm trying to pull everybody here. If I, if I had a fucking million trillion dollars, best believe I'm going to help my people. I'm going to help my friends. I'm going to help my sisters. I'm going to give them a piece. Because it's like, you can't enjoy it by yourself. I like enjoying shit with my people. Like, I like enjoying shit with my friends and family and shit like that. Like, I'm not that type of female to be selfish like that. So, if I'm up high, I'm going to pull somebody up high else with, up there with me. And that's just the way I roll like that. It's just crazy how people is just hate her. Like, the, the job that I do, it's crazy. But the job that I do, it's a bunch of haterism at, at, involved with my job. Like, I have my family business as well, but I have a side job that I do as well. And there's a lot of haterism and women that hate on other women and just stuff like that. And I just become immune to the shit. Cause you can hate on me all you want. I'm going to pay you no attention. I'm going to pay your ass dust. Like, for real. Because if you got to hate on me, then I'm not, I don't need to be around you. You don't need to be around me. And that's just the way it is. Step your YouTube game up, as we all should, if we're trying to become on a level to where we can be talked about like Tasha K. I'm quite sure. Whatever she doing behind the scenes is how is she getting her information. If she being sued, she being sued. If she doing this, if she going to court and ain't going to court, she ain't going to court. Susie ass ain't going to court either. Maybe they don't have to go to court, because I'm quite sure if they needed to be appeared in court, I'm quite sure they would be there. So people need to quit pushing that narrative about Tasha K this and Tasha K that. Fuck you. That's what I would say, like she said. Double fuck you. Get your brand up, step your YouTube up, step whatever your game is up. And be able to be like the Tasha K or whatever your name gonna be or whatever it is. And on that note, YouTube, I'm out. Because I'm reaching into my destination to get my good good. Way out, like, comment, subscribe, hit that notification bell, and I'll talk to you guys later. You too.